Hello friends, I am Nitesh Pradham from Labby Programming. It is also a beginner program in multi-sim. In this uh, beginner program of multi-sim, uh, I will show you how can we just a glow LED. Okay, how can we just a glow an LED. So for that, press Ctrl W. Okay, come to the master database. And the master database, there is all group are present. In the all group, there is uh, click on the all groups and come to the diode. If you will come to the diode, you will find LOD. Now you will find LED. Now you can see the green LED. Okay, blue LED, green LED. Okay, green LED, blue LED. So there, green LED and blue LED are present. So you can take this. So okay, it is light emitting diode. We know the LED is light emitting diode. So now come to the basic and take one resistance. You can take one resistance. Come to the basic. How can we can Okay, we will come to the group, we will come to the basic and we will take the resistance. Okay, we will, we will take, we can take one resistance and we will place here. After that, again click on the basic, come to the source. Okay, take uh, source. Now, come to the power sources. First one is the power source, take one DC. Okay, take one DC. Okay, and take one ground. Now, Make a connection. Uh, try to make a connection. Well, I am try, trying to make. Now connect like this. Okay. And if uh, I want to, uh, okay. If you want to rotate, so you can rotate by pressing Control R. Okay. By pressing Control R, you can rotate. Okay. I am connecting like this. You can also connect. So you can take two ground. If you want, you can take two ground. Either you can. Uh, Manage by using one ground also. Okay, I am taking and okay, run. Okay, because uh, value uh, I am giving value, so it is uh, okay glowing. Okay, okay. So now, if you want to glow, it's glowing. Okay. You can change the value if you will give the value is 2 so it will not glow let's check it's off if you will give the value okay if you will give the value uh, 3 then it will be glow okay so it will not glow also for 3 so we will give the value 3 point let's check the value with the 3.5 3.5 Okay, now run. It's also, also now it's working. Now check. Give the value 5. Okay, it's also not working. Now try to uh, give the value 10. 12. Okay, now it's going on 10. Why? Because uh, if you will no, the property. Okay, so if uh, you can check the property, there is not any kind of information why it's working in the, with the cell. Well, okay, now again I am making same program to explain uh, same thing, taking one green LED. Okay, so what is the? Uh, I am taking one green LED. So you can see here the voltage okay is 3.45 with a 20 milliampere okay with the 2.45 every 10 uh, milliampere it will work so now i am taking this one i am taking here taking one ground taking one dc power source now i am taking one resistor now i am taking one resistor and making a connection okay now i am making connection for this and i am giving the value is a 4 changing the value is 4 volt okay 4 volt now i am connecting this one like this and now i will use only one ground to complete the circuit in the previous one i have i have taken two grounds to complete the circuit but in this i am taking one ground Okay, now 
so it's not working okay it's not working if i will reduce the size of resistance if i will reduce the size of resistance then what if i am taking the 5 50 ohm if i will take the 50 ohm it's working because it needs 20 milli ampere okay it needs 20 milli ampere at least so by using this it will be uh, milli ampere so uh, if you will uh, measure then you will find here uh, we are taking more than 20 milli ampere okay if the well if the current is not uh, more than 20 milli ampere so your led will not work okay so now if you want to uh, know how to use switches so you can uh, watch my previous video okay so thank you for watching this video